All right, this is my third video on the SAMS book Commodore 64 slash 128 assembly language programming by Mark Andrews. Chapter 11 is all about high resolution graphics and it starts on page 185 of the book and on page 193 there's a basic program which plots points on the screen in basic and then it was later translated into assembly language but in this video I'm going to concentrate on the basic program and show that off and show how that works as it was listed in the program uh, minus the comments so the first five lines right here basically turn on graphics high resolution graphics mode and then there's a a for loop that runs to draw a vertical line and a for loop to draw a horizontal line and this is the blackboard program so let's run it I'll show you what the program does and it's running in warped mode so it's extremely slow in basic so you can see how slow that is in basic it's even slower if warp mode is, is not on so what I did to further help myself try to understand exactly how the uh, program was working was I, I tried to dissect the program a little and I made a copy of it into high res dash 2 and for me this is easier to understand the the first few lines here turn on the uh, high resolution graphics mode initialize of course the, the the screen and set the background color to 16 and then the, there's a there's a subroutine down here that plots a point. So this first subroutine does the bit arithmetic required in order to plot a x y coordinate onto the screen. The x y coordinate is set up by this horizontal position and the vertical position, and then it goes subs to that to plot the point. The first go sub is to plot the point. The second go sub thirteen ten is just I, I added was just to take a keyboard input before it draws the second one. So in this program it plots a point, waits for the keyboard, plots another point, waits for the keyboard input, plots another point. So let's run that. Hopefully you'll see what I'm talking about. And see here it's clearing the screen, plots the first point, and I'm going to hit a key, draws a pixel right next to it, and then right underneath, right underneath. And then that ends the program still in high res mode right there. So way back about the time when I was still in college I had discovered this C program that drew a circle and it was it was like a fast circle and I adapted it for Turbo C and I tried to get it working on this video but I couldn't get it to compile uh, and I didn't I, I just I couldn't figure it out so I, one of the reasons this is a fast circle drawing routine is that it doesn't use any geometric functions or trigonometry functions like sine or cosine in order to calculate the points. I decided I would try to adapt the the C program and you see it here almost in its entirety here. Let me see if I can get it to scroll up a little. There's some includes up at the top. There's a, a while loop. So while there's no keyboard hit, go ahead and draw a circle with a random X, random a Y, and a random radius. And I was like, wow, that should be easy. It's fairly, fairly simple. There's a bit operation happening right here and right here and in a couple of places or some bit operations. But other than that, it's just putting, it's just plotting pixels onto the screen. So I, I went ahead and adapted that. I created uh, using a combination of the program out of that book and that program. I figured out how to do that and I adapted it here and I fully adapted it. There is one part in the program where it's doing an AND comparison if X and 1. So in other words if X is odd then plot the points with the with the bit operation. And that's simulated here. I, I discovered in basic do it the same exact way. If X and 1 then plot the point. And then it plots the points here just like in the other program and let's go ahead and run it. I wanted to show you because I was kind of excited I got this working and it's kind of neat. Let's, uh, let's give it a shot. And again this is in warp mode. It's not doing this that fast. <laughs> Even though it's fast, for, for uh, it's called a fast circle routine. 
it's darn slow on the Commodore 64 to plot these points and it's running at a thousand eleven hundred percent speed right now I know it would be a lot faster in assembly language but I didn't uh, take the time to <laughs> convert the whole program I could have used the one on the other the book source code that I have already achieved in my last two videos but I didn't take the time to go ahead and adapt it this was cool enough just by itself so anyway I will put the source code up on my github and I thought this was cool it's just randomly plotting a circle drawing a circle on the screen in different X and Y position different radius the one thing that I would have liked to have changed about this program would have been to have, have had a random color but I think that's pushing it <laughs> for now but uh, anyway just drawing the circle was cool enough I hope you enjoyed watching